when the top load washing machine is placed in a balanced position as this machine but the machine still vibrates moves and oscillates from its place so what could be its reason and today i will tell you its reasons as well after that its working principle the how its automatic balancing system works and how the machine performs it through which you will automatically know how to fix its vibration if the top load washing machine is being super balanced but the drum still vibrates then i will divide its faults into two categories the first when the user makes any fault in it due to which as well the machine being balanced still vibrates and due to which it can fall as well so i will tell you what precautions you have to take that the machine does not move from its place at all then the second category is when the machine itself makes any fault means when any part of the machine gets bad and i will tell you what parts of the machine get bad after which the machine does this problem so i will describe all these things in today's video and will make you a master in using and repairing the machine now i will tell you first that when the user makes a mistake what fault does the machine makes so as you can see i have removed the half door from the door lock to show you the view of the drum inside that how it makes fault and then we'll tell you its solution as well after which the machine will not make this fault again now i will start the machine on the spin cycle because normally the machine makes this fault on the spin cycle as i have set the machine on spin cycle i will now press the start button to run the machine now as you can see the machine drum started and rotated abnormally and the drum touched the sides of the machine body then stopped now you can see that the problem fault or error code is started showing on its display which is ue now what is the ue error code i will tell you about the error in the next video because this video is about why does the washing machine vibrates now i will tell you what mistake the user made that caused this vibration problem so this happened that when the user put the clothes inside the machine drum the clothes got jumbled so whenever putting laundry inside the top load washing machine as i have put some towels inside the drum to make you understand so what you have to do never ever put the clothes this way inside the machine always put the clothes one by one and freely this way as i am to prevent the machine from making this problem again now when you put clothes this way in the machine as how i am right now then the machine will make this problem occasionally rather than all the time but if it still makes this problem then come closer to the machine and see that whether the clothes are untidy and messy as how i am showing you so if they are jumbled place it tidy inside the drum and start the machine now i have placed the clothes unjumbled and now let us see what happens now the machine will start and now see that the machine is better than before now let me tell you that if you face such a situation then you can take these precautions before putting the laundry in the machine but if its drum still vibrates then go to your machine and balance the clothes inside the drum as how i told you then the drum would be automatically balanced but now if you practiced all these precautions but still the machine makes this vibration problem and does not balance then let me tell you what its fault would be then now for repairing this fault you will have to reach its inner drum and you will have to open it and let me tell you this as well what is the principle at which the drum balancing system works when you unbolt the machine to open its drum then first of all disconnect the electricity supply second close the water inlet supply and remove the water pipe connection from the machine backside now see that i have opened the drum so please observe i will pull it upward and now see that it has come out of the washing machine now please observe this and see this is its outer drum and this outer drum is held through these four rods installed here see one two three and four all these rods installed in the outer drum have spring beneath them and this outer drum is held and balanced through them see now i am pressing the drum up and down to show you but when the machine vibrates the fault of these springs and rod is less, but the fault of this inner drum is more. Now, let me make you all understand what its principle is, 
due to which this drum balances automatically. Now, next, let's talk about what principle or mechanism is used in this drum, due to which this drum automatically gets balanced. So let me budge it a little, and let's check it out. I feel like water is inside. How did the water went in? Should the water be inside? So let me explain you this as well. Now, see this, what did I do next? As you are seeing this stainless steel drum and the ring attached on its top, I have separated them both. And see that the water is inside this ring. And this stainless steel drum is balanced while manufacturing, as it has no such thing special in it. But the main technique is used here with its ring. Now, the first thing I will do is, measure the weight of this ring. It is important right now to know the ring's total weight. Now I kept the ring on the weight machine. So, the weight of this ring is 2.268 kilograms, and I have to note the value, but it is easy for me now because I am filming the video. I will watch the video in case I forgot. And why am I measuring its weight? Let me explain it in the later section of the video. Now to show you I am doing this work. Let me do a hole in the ring. And now observe, please. So as you saw, a lot of water has come out of this ring. So now, let me tell you, why did I measure the weight of this ring? I did the weight of the ring because when I fit the ring back into the machine, so that I could add the same amount of water, and get the exact weight of the ring, then I would close this hole in the ring I did. Now, this ring is empty of water, and let's do the weight of the ring. And see how the weight of the ring is only 1.198 kilograms left, which means that around 1 kilogram of water was inside this ring. Now let me tell you why this water is added to the drum ring. Now, see I have come back to the machine, and now I will explain to you what is the function of water inside the ring when the machine rotates. So, when the machine has these clothes inside the drum, these clothes are not always kept in a balanced position, as due to which the weight of clothes on one side of the drum could be more than the other side. Now, this happens when the machine drum rotates on spin mode, then that side of the drum with more weight gets heavier and unbalanced, then the water in the ring on its opposite side maintains the drum balance. Now, for example, if the clothing's weight on this side of the drum is more, the water will gather here on its opposite side, making the drum to be balanced easily. So, this is the technique of using water in the ring to balance the drum. And now, if your machine has this problem, it means that the water has leaked from the ring due to a crack or hole in the ring, and this has made the machine drum unable to balance correctly. This was for today's video, so see you in the next one.